Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to show you how to find the point that is discontinuous in here. So for the first one, we can see that this is about positive number one, the absolute value and the absolute value. That means this one they always greater than number zero. This one in here is greater than or equals to number one because the absolute value, the smallest one that is number zero, that means number one number one is bigger than number zero so that means we don't have this continuous in here now let's go to the second one we see that we have the fraction in here so we cannot divide by number zero so s plus number seven minus one cannot equals to number zero in here so I will put this one go in here. So for this one, we have two equations. We cannot equal to positive number one and negative number one. Because this is about the absolute value so I will put number 7 go to the right number 7 go to the right so we have the final answer in here number 1 minus 7 we have negative number 6 this one we have negative number 8 so we can write the first one in here next we cannot divide by number zero in this one in here. So we have this number in here. And the next one, the condition of f n, they cannot equals to number zero. So s minus nine cannot equals to number zero in here the next one this one that is the bit fraction in here the bit one so we cannot divide by number zero in here and here so we need to know that the range of arc tan That is for negative b over 2 to positive b over 2. So that means this one we have b over 2. So b over 2 is bigger than b over 2 in the single bracket in here. So that means this one they always cannot, cannot equal to number 0. So we just have only this one. So we have b over 4 to create about b over 4 in here. We need to know that octane number 1 equals to b over 4. So that means for s equals to number 1 from here. So we have s equals to 1 over 4. Because if we put this one go back in here, you got octane of number one, and that is b over number four. b over number four minus b over number four, you got number zero. So we have the final answer in here. This is the end. Thank you for watching.